Hello, model railroaders, and in my last video, we took a look at the compatibility of lock on it throttles like the Olenbrook Daisy here, or the Digitrax, or the, the old Merklin mobile station, and of course the Fleischmann. Profi boss, but it really doesn't matter if there isn't enough power to run the trains on the layout. Now the command station, in this case the Picos smart box, otherwise known as the Azo mobile control, comes with a power supply of about two point. 25, 2.25 amps, not really sufficient to run lots of trains with sound functions. So in this video, using the Pico, let it speak for itself, the smart control CD adapter, connected to a an Olenbrook booster, apologize for the mess, this is an Olenbrook 63240 supplied by a 4.6 amps Olenbrook transformer. So it's like having an increase of more or less 100%. Uh, the other issue with the smart box is that there is only one ECOS link connector so in order to have the throttles huge selection of throttles so everyone can join in the fun I must have the lock on net converter also an Azo product under the Pico brand name here in this case. So having one Ecos link and two devices, the Loconet converter and the CD box means that the solution which arrived only yesterday is the Azo Ecos link terminal. Two Ecos links on the front panel and there are four on the back panel, so now there are plenty of connectors here. So now with double the power, things are moving along much better than the stock transformer that came with the Pico Smart Control. So let's take for example, we're connected, blue or purple or blue light. Okay, so there goes the, this is an ESU locomotive right here. So, lights, pantograph on function three. Again, uh, just to let's take the Daisy Olenbrook radio controller. This thing is so light and easy to handle, and you don't need a degree in quantum physics to use it. Uh, let's go to uh, it's already there on address 94. You can see the, the throttle on the, on the Pico Smart Control, which is also the Azo Mobile Control. And of course, the, there, there he goes. Uh, 
the same thing would happen here on the flash mill. So, local. So with the combination of Azo slash Pico, we can add another power district using another CD box, of course, which means another booster and another transformer. That's the next step. And since there are now plenty of Ecoslink connectors, the things run much smoother. Uh, You can also connect external power here using the screw terminals or the jack here can be a DC transformer or an AC transformer which gives a bit of flexibility uh, thank you so much and I wish you a good day and uh, once again keep the trains rolling